Welcome to the Hamlin Village History Project. I'm Megan Harding. I'm an anthro major. Archaeology is my specialty. Um, I'm doing an honors project on the Hall of Science. So the Hall of Science was built in 1887, and it was the third major building built on campus. So it lined up perfectly with um, Old Main, and it's right where the Blue Garden is today. And the way that people demolished buildings in the 70s, they basically put all their garbage in the basement, took out the top two levels, and then just covered it all up. So basically what we're digging is everything that they left behind. It's still perfectly in place underneath us. Every day we come out and we go through the hole, we actually pull out the trowels, all the tools, screens, and slowly but surely pull small amounts of dirt out so that we can sift it and look for anything that's unusual or is, I guess, not of this place or not naturally produced has been left here by somebody else and then we try to provide context to what the history may have looked like here at Hamlin throughout time. Well we started with this post hole, we did a shovel test and found this which was like a one in a million chance so Ariana put a really good flag in the ground and then we opened it up into this one by one first and this one second and we found different doll pieces. We think that it's late 1800s, early 1900s, like an antique German disc doll. We found different pottery. The pottery that um, I actually figured out what, like, who made it, the manufacturer, is from the late 1800s. So one of the things that's really cool about this class is that there's a lot of different majors that are represented here. We have some students who are elementary education majors, some students that are journalism majors, and marketing majors like myself. We've been marketing the class through social media. We have the Facebook account, we have a Twitter account, and we also have an Instagram account that all feeds to the Facebook page. We've also made a banner that we put in the Anderson lobby um, advertising our events. We had two open digs. One of them we invited the community to come and help us d in digging the Hall of Science. Well, we invited fifth graders over from Hamlin Elementary and we went in before and kind of told them what archaeology was, show them different materials we use like trowel and whatnot. And then we had them come dig and they did they got to dig and then shift through dirt and then plot some things on a grid. And then we went back to see how they enjoyed it and what their favorite part was. Well, we're using this project as a way to build community identity. So it's kind of a, more of a bonding moment for the entire community and to generate interest in general in history and Hamlin history for sure. I'm a history major and my job for this is to look through the ar archives in Hamlin and research what uh, the, or how Hamlin's expanded within the Midway community and I'm going to compare that to uh, the Midway Historical Society and hopefully get some interviews with some people that have been that have been living in the Midway area for a while so I can uh, look into the interchanging role that Hamlin's played and it's expanding like it's expanding see how that how it's changed over time. And people from other disciplines, they can bring different aspects to this. They can um, give you new insights that as only studying archaeology I never would have thought of. And you really have no idea what you're walking over every single day. Like you would have no idea how all of these things would be a couple feet underneath you when you walk across this grass. I guess that works with the one man's trash is another man's treasure.